And all you need to solve these things is uh, uh, basically this relation here. So the question uh, 47, I'll read it to you. The, you have no hope of, of reading it, unfortunately. Uh, but it's there on, on, on the uh, study aids website. It says, if the distance from a light source is doubled, its brightness is reduced by a factor of 2, 4, 8, or 16. We just said it, right? If the luminosity is equal, sorry, if the brightness is equal to the luminosity over the distance squared, right? And I take, say, uh, the luminosity to be 1. Then when I have the distance of 1, I have this ratio 1 over 1 squared is 1. And when I double the distance, then the brightness, the luminosity is 1, but now the distance is 2. It's, I get 1 quarter, right? So as I double the distance, the luminosity, uh, sorry, the brightness is uh, reduced by a factor of 4. So the correct answer to this one is B. Okay? So let's take up some more. Okay, now a little bit trickier ones. Now we have two stars, X and Y. Uh, that have the same brightness, okay, so they appear to be equally bright, but the distance of x is five times that of y. That is, x is five, five times more, distance, more distant than, than y. So what is then the luminosity of x compared to that of y? Right? So now, uh, what you can use is basically, so now we are asked about the luminosity. Well, one relationship is that the brightness is luminosity over the distance squared, or that the luminosity is equal to the brightness times the distance squared. Okay, so let's make a little table. Uh, here we have star x. And here we have star y. And then we have the distance. And we have the brightness. And then we have to figure out what the luminosity is. So if I pick the distance uh, of y to be 1, uh, then in those units, uh, since x is 5 times more distance, then the distance of x is 5. They are equally bright, right? So I can take the brightness uh, to be 1 for both, right? And then I just need to use this relation here. So for x, I have 5 squared is 25 times 1. The luminosity is 25 in some units. For star y, uh, B is 1, D is 1, and B times D squared is 1. Okay? So then I conclude that uh, X must be 25 times more luminous uh, than Y if it is to appear equally bright, being 5 times more distant than Y. So the answer here is A. Okay, so the, the simple, so you use either this relation or this is the same relation rewritten uh, uh, differently. Here it's solved for brightness, here it's solved for luminosity. 
So all, you always have uh, 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 one of them given. So which one you're going to use depends on the circumstances. Here, the brightness is given, right? And uh, uh, you also know how the distances are related and you need to figure out to compare their luminosity. Then you use this one here. Make a little table. You have two stars, X and Y. They can be U and W, whatever. Then you know for distances of them. You pick arbitrarily the closer one to be at the unit distance. Then the more distant one is five times more distant. They are equally bright. You choose units so that the brightness of each is one. And then you just apply this formula to, get out the, uh, to, to figure out the luminosity. Okay, let's try uh, 49. Stars S and P have the same luminosity. So now the luminosity is given. And the distance of S is three times that of P. The brightness of S is nine times one ninth, three one third, right? So now it's, you don't even have to do that, but I'll do it anyway so that you can see you can use the similar method. Now the luminosity is the same, and you know that the distance of S is three times that of P. So then its brightness is going to be reduced by a factor of nine, right? So then the brightness of S is one ninth that of P. But you can do the same thing. You can make a little table. And now you have stars S and P instead of uh, X and Y, uh, you know that S uh, is three times more distant than P, so if you pick the distance to the closer one, one, then the distance to S is three, right? Now you are given the luminosities of both, uh, and they are the same, so I'll pick one, right? So then now I, I need to use this one. So in the first case, the brightness is going to be equal to 1 over 3 squared, which is 9, so it's 1 ninth. And for P, L is 1, D is 1, and the brightness is 1. OK? So either one of these two uh, are to be used. If the luminosity is given, and you need to compare the stars, then you use this relation here. If the brightness is given and you have to compare the luminosities of the stars, then you use this one here.